It is a story that we first broke on the now at four o'clock. Yeah, the scene has been cleared. 10 News reporter Jessica Chen is joining us. Now, Jessica, we understand several people were injured in that crash. Yeah, we were told some of those people did have some developmental disabilities. So when first responders arrived, it was really hard for them to understand their level of pain. So at least eight of them were sent to the hospital. Now this crash did extend to a pretty wide area. It essentially started from where I'm standing here at the pole all the way to that red light you see over there. Now here's Sky 10 video of what it looked like. You can see several cars, at least five were involved. The white van you see in the video was carrying the group of disabled people Unfortunately, none appear to have serious injuries. Police say this crash started after a driver slammed into several cars stopped on Greenfield Street, causing a chain reaction. The driver told them he suffered an anxiety attack and lost control of his car. They're not calling it suspicious. And again, fortunately, none of the people involved in this crash had serious injuries. In El Cajon, Jessica Chen, 10 News. Now to a developing